What's going on YouTube? Thank you for watching JG Tech Vlog and for today's video I'm going to be showing you how to bypass the Google account on uh, any device, any Android device that is. This is similar to the iCloud lock that's on the Apple iPhones and so with the Google though it's less, uh, let me just say it's actually less secure so there's p ways actually to uh, bypass it. This method works again for all Android devices that have a Google account on them. The only uh, problem is that certain phones have different ways of getting into the, the internet. You need to get to Google to download an app so you can uh, tell the phone what to do. And so for the LG Leon, this is an LG Leon for Metro PCS this is how it can be done and you can do this on similar other phones as well for example in this way the way to access the internet is actually click on that gear button right there at the, uh, at the bottom and you scroll down to update word suggestions click on legal information then you just scroll all the way down until you see a link there it is when you click on that you click on Metro web don't click on the Chrome click OK so now when it goes there just go to google.com just search for uh, I'm just trying to press that X button alright and let me see quick short cook shortcut maker APK download once you click on that, you download this right here. Now there's a couple of them actually. Let's try this one, the first one. Some people be downloading viruses or making viruses to download, so you have to make sure you download the correct one. So let's let's try this one right here. Download APK from so starting download let's give it a second until it finishes alright so click on settings and then you have to see unknown sources It'll allow installation of apps from sources other than the Play Store because we downloaded it directly from uh, the internet from the browser we didn't go through the Play Store so you have to allow to do that so press OK click on install you accept open it up alright now so what we're gonna do is actually gonna tell the phone to reset itself so you go to reset settings and what you're going to do is going to go to one, two, three, the third one. And you click on try. And you're going to reset the phone. Delete all. This phone will start the device. Uh, okay. And now it's erasing. So after it gets erased, hopefully you'll be taking out uh, the Google account that was logged in there. And now this can be used for bad purposes as well so I don't recommend that the only reason I am uh, showing you guys this video is for those that actually uh, forgot their passwords onto their phones it's actually restarting right now and so this phone is actually for a client that I have but he knows the email account that's attached to this phone he just forgot the password and so many of you say well he can actually just go to google.com and click on reset password or something like that well he tried that as well but every time he tried to reset the password it will actually send him a code for verification that this is actually his phone to here but he can't lo get into the phone he can't access it so he can't get that password as well or that code so we have no option but to do this bypass and again this actually actually works on many other phones uh, the only difference is that you have to f figure out a way to get to the browser first then download that app that I showed you to um, ha have control over the phone itself and uh, allow it to reset itself okay, just give it a second while this is starting up and we're gonna click next by the way I make sure you did all of those previous process and you were connected to the internet anyways we're gonna go ahead and uh, I can skip this for now I think we don't really need it and you're in the phone good to go 
All right, I hope this uh, video helped you out. If it did, please give it a like. And if you have any questions, leave it a comment down below and I'll help you out. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you for watching.